I'm J.R. Butler, co-founder of The Shift Group, and you're listening to Merchants of Change. This is a podcast about transferring the skills and behaviors we acquire as athletes into being a professional technology salesperson. Each week, we'll introduce you to a top performer who will help us understand how they became professional merchants of change. Well, listen, the good news for everybody is they're not just going to have to listen to you and I chatter all the time. We're going to bring on a guest every week and we're just going to, we're going to talk about, you know, their, their, their path to sales, the things that they think matter. Um, and like how they show up every day as a merchant of change. So John, this is exciting, dude. I'm, I'm pumped, uh, obviously, as always to work with you and this is going to be fun, man. Thank you. I for, love it. Uh, we'll keep, thank we'll you. keep them fun too. I know we're just talking about the, the podcast right now, but I think me and you kind of interrogating people is going to be pretty fun too. Hilarious. When I was lost thinking about going to law school because that's what I thought I was supposed to do. I was having a conversation with a guy at a bar in Marlboro uh, that knew me from men's league hockey. He asked me what I was going to do. I told him, I, I think I'm going to go take the LSAT and go to law school. And he legitimately laughed in my face. And he's like, that's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> and I, I, was probably, like, I probably would have laughed too. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what do you mean, man? He's like, He's like, listen, he's like, you're, you're obviously a, a competitive dude. You're, you're super resilient, you know, to play division one hockey, you had to work your butt off. You're competitive. He's like, listen, I, I own a, a tech, a tech business. I'm looking for like entry level salespeople. I think you should come and try it out. And, uh, and he's like, you know, I guarantee you'll make quarter million dollars within three years. And I was kind of like, dude, I don't own a computer. Like literally, like literally, I was like, I was walking around town applying to banks, and they're like, "What are you doing?" They're like, you're they're just like we're, we're we're closing tomorrow. Actually, we don't yeah, exist yeah. anymore. That's, that's true. They were like, "Yeah, we're going." Sorry, we're going out of business, and we're super regulated. So I was that guy. I actually worked in a liquor store in my hometown. And uh, funny story about that, but I was I was in this liquor store, and a few months later, a, a woman was in there talking about how her daughter just got accepted to Holy Cross, and I was like, "Oh, I just graduated from there." And she was like, looking at me as the cashier, and she was like, "No, it's uh, no, it's a bit, it's a, it's a good school." And I was like, "Yeah, no, I know." <laughs> If you're interested in working with us, please come find us at www.shiftgroup.io. 